Let's start with this very first plant. This is called Caladium. This is given by my friend. We exchanged. I gave her some flowers and she also gave me this Caladium. I really like this because it's not too hard to grow. You can just plant it in a pot or even in a plastic container. As what I did is just a uh, poly bag. It's called a poly bag. I just planted it here. And look, it's very beautiful. It's got pink and green in it. All right. Another kind of palladium is this one. Look, it's got another uh, color. It's still pink, dark, and white pink with green. But this is another variety. You see, they've got different color with the previous Kaladjum. And of course, I also have some aloe veras. They're not very hard to grow. I just planted them and they will grow on their own. And this one is a fortune plant. You see, they are budding. I planted four pieces of fortune plant. I really like it because you don't have to take care of it. You don't have to cultivate closely to take care closely of them. You just plant them and you let them grow. You see, they are budding. They are budding, so it's not it's not too hard to grow. And of course, I also have some. I also have some snake plant okay and some I also have some another variety of snake plant is this one look I just uh, planted them and they have new buds now growing not, not too hard to take care of you just plant them and you let them grow of course you have to water them on the first few weeks and then you just let them grow and there you go it's growing and I also have smaller ones look they're growing some already died it's too bad but these ones are growing and I have another variety here I really didn't have time now to take care of them since I'm taking care of my newborn baby but that's the very advantage of snake plants because you don't have to take care of them and this one I forgot the name of this uh, is it ginseng ginseng tree ginseng plant I heard it's a ginseng and this one's one of my favorite yeah you see it looks like a butterfly this was given by this was given by mommy Cham in Ahoy and I gave it to my mother in copies and mama gave me back when I'm already here in Kalipo Aklan. You see it's very beautiful. It it died several times but as long as the root is still there it grows. So I really like this plant, it's beautiful. And this one, another plant, it's really beautiful. I don't know the name, but I really like it. This was given by a friend as well. We had, we just bartered. I gave her some of my flowers and she gave me also some of hers. Now let's move to the next, to the other side. The other side has a lot of cactus. And aloe vera there, another kind of aloe vera, another plant, aloe vera. And this one, this one is, um, how do they call this? I forgot the name. But this still, this, this is still another variety of succulent. And then another cactus. See, some here are budding. And oh, some more succulents, some more succulents. There you go, some more succulents. I really like them because um, the the leaves the leaves.
leaves. I heard that they absorb toxins in the environment so you can have fresh air. But I just put this outside since I really don't have time to water them every day to cultivate them. So if they're outside, they can have the rain. Then this is another one. Singonia. I forgot the name. I heard it's Singonia. Oh, you have malunggay. My son got some malunggay. Where did you get this? From there. From there? What is it for? It's for the Oh, thank you, JM. Give me some. Thank you. Say hello. 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 <laughs> okay, there we have here the some Singonia. And see, it's got different colors Why? when it when the when the leaf is still young it's pink and then it becomes green when it when it when it gets older Singonium. and here I have another cactus see it's got a lot of babies I only got three pots of this but the babies I replanted in in another pot so right now I have a lot of baby cactus they mm. said that mm. If it's single, it's cactus. When it's plural, it's cacti. <laughs> okay, so I've got a lot of cacti. Is this one or small? Yeah, it's a baby cactus. See, it's a baby cactus. Another baby cactus. And this one is another kind of cactus. See, it gets longer and longer. And here is another kind of cactus. There you go. So many babies, a lot of babies. I can replant them when I when I get to have the time. Is and this one is a baby. Is a young um, blue turnate, a young blue turnate. What a young. Yeah, it's still a baby, you know, JM. It's still a baby. It has a purple flower. It gets older. What's that? You see, I I have a lot of baby cactus. Hey, look at this! Yeah, baby cactus. Look. Yeah, and that's the succulent. Another succulent. I have a lot is of it, baby cactus. Is look. it um, that it has growing. a lot of plants? Mm hmm maybe. They're growing. Cactus, cactus, cactus. You see, I am a plantita myself also, so oh, I enjoy. Oh. Planting cactus. There, another cactus. Another cactus. This this is the mother one. This is what I planted, and then this is what I planted, and then another two babies came out. And there's another one. See, JM, I have a lot of cactus, right? Mommy likes cactus. And there is another succulent. And right here. I have here, yeah, hold on, some um, crotons. This one is a crotons. The name is crotons, or in our dialect, we call it pasao. Pasao is a beautiful plant. Look, look, so, look, they're very beautiful. I I have a friend, Ati Melsi. Shout out, John. Ati Melsi Seraspe. They moved to, they moved their stuff from. Kalibu to Burakai and they have a lot of water bottles, empty water bottles. So I asked them and I use it to plant instead of buying pots, I plant them in a water bottle. If you want to put them inside, indoors, you will just put this in a you will just put the whole thing in a in a pot. Okay? These are the crotons. Crotons. See, it's beautiful. Especially when they have rain, when they when they are outside and 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 it rains they really they really bloom see it's very beautiful i really like them another kind of crotons and this oh, one is no. another plant i like it it's really beautiful it doesn't have fruit but it's beautiful another crotons another crotons See, these are my plants. I really like them. I enjoy planting. I also plant vegetables, but 
sometimes I also plant flowers. Another variety. It's beautiful. Look. <laughs> the leaf. It's got a, a continuous leaf here. You see? God is a God of wonders. Even the, the shape of the leaves. It's all awesome and really amazing because they're beautiful they're wonderfully and fearfully made <laughs> there are another crotons and there are another ornamental plant and this one is one of my favorite as well you can put it indoors and another crotons another plant there and here i have a booking dahlia but it's got no flower yet of course, some other beautiful flowers. I really like them. Another kind of crotons. Crotons. And snake plant. This one is a snake plant. And of course, there's another one. Another snake plant here. Another snake plant here. You see, it gets very sunny the previous day, so they they haven't drunk water from the rain but it's got new shoots see it's got new shoots here so they're growing and yeah these are my plants my beautiful plants i really like them and this one is a lemon some lemon i am not sure if these are lemon or pomelo yeah i think they're pomelo and of course another caladium oh no i think my friend the worm ate this so sad but that's okay there another caladium they're beautiful caladium there you go they're very beautiful and here another kind of plant i forgot the name but they are beautiful you can put them in words and this one is a melendres melendres is a beautiful plant it's a beautiful flower outside i will show you how does the flower look like later on let me finish here first and this one is a bangkok or a dwarf kalachuchi i forgot the name who can tell me the name you can comment it you can write the name on the comment section if you know it see these are beautiful when when they when they bear flowers they have pink flowers and they're very beautiful they are my favorite flowers so this one another singonium and there and this one is a hanging plant i've got a lot of hanging plant here let me show you here they've got a, let's finish jim got a lot of hanging plants see some worms are eating on it are eating the leaves they're hanging plants they're very nice you can put them on your wall and they will just hang so let's move on to the next side on the next side, I still have another kinds of flowers here. I put it on a shady part. You see, this is a uh, this is a uh, JM. This is a uh, rambutan tree, and under the rambutan tree, I have here some plants because they get burned when it's very sunny. There, these are my plants. And they are very beautiful. And this one is a, is a medicinal plant, Lampunaya or Mayana. And this one is another variety of butterfly plant. There, it's beautiful. And this one is, I really like it because it's got white and green leaf. It's beautiful. Okay, and another cactus there. Let's go to another side. I will show you the I will show you the 
this one is another caladium there and I forgot the name of this plant but it's got orange flower it's really beautiful when it buds when it when the flower blooms it's really beautiful and we also have there Iba or Kamyas have you have you tasted Kamyas juice it's very sour so it's very rich in vitamin C here I have some more Bangkok or Barf and Chuchi and I also have Dwarf Balete I put it in a pot Dwarf Balete and here are some dragon fruit dragon fruit okay and also have some more cactus wow a lot of cactus 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 everywhere cactus I really like cactus since they absorb toxins so I don't like the dust or the toxins go inside the house so I plant a lot of cactus here they there they they grow easily no need to cultivate them closely and look they are beautiful see cactus and we also have here the chancing and of course don't forget the the morning glory they get they they are beautiful in the morning but already in the afternoon so the flower is now closed lots of them and here is another crotons another variety of crotons and of course another cactus 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 oh here the flower of uh, the flower of a uh, the flower of a uh, dwarf kalachuchi isn't it beautiful i really like it it's very beautiful and another cactus another cactus the name of this cactus is uh, bunny bunny ears as you can see here the cactus form bunny ears it's not really perfect bunny ears but it's I think it's really nice there whoever wants cactus I can send you for free there. bunny ears here another dwarf palette for it to become a little bit bigger so I can cook them and put in the malungai with with gata or coconut milk and here are some another uh, Bangkok or dwarf kalachichi it's really beautiful and of course another bunny ears but you cannot see clearly since it's Okay, let me show you the flower of the flower of Melendres. The flower of Melendres is that one. It looks like um, it looks like um, cherry blossoms, but they're really beautiful, especially, uh, especially during May. May season, it's really beautiful. They bloom. So let me show you. There you go. There. Okay. There. The flower is really beautiful. Okay. I think that's all for today. 
I will I will see you again next time. Thank you so much for watching my YouTube channel. Again, this is Marovic Blaza vlogging my plants, both ornamental and and uh, medicinal plants in our backyard. Thank you. See you. Bye bye.